Hi everybody and welcome to Take Back the Kitchen. I'm here with my special friend Lana. Hello. Lana's visiting from Chicago and we know each other from having worked together in Spain in the World Expo. A good two decades ago. Yes, it's a good two decades ago and let's... Mama, let, yes. Um, this is a new one. Okay, thank you honey. <laughs> We're going to talk to Lana for a minute. Lana? Yes. You had a lot of multicultural food at the World's Fair in Seville where we worked and met one another. How does this Indian potato and cauliflower dish compare to all the, all the ethnic food you ate at the expo? Oh, this is way better. And it's much spicier. And they didn't really have that much ethnic food. It was mostly like tapas. Yeah, it was pretty good though. They had Malay. I remember a lot of Malaysian food. You had Malaysian food. I had a lot of you Malaysian didn't take food. Me on a Malaysian food plate. Well, you know, mm-hmm. maybe you should have hung out with me more. Um, so, welcome, mm. welcome Thank to you. the blog. She's Thank a loyal you. reader, and she lives in Chicago, so maybe oh. she, she she's not very used to you know spice out in the Midwest. But um, that's right. It's not like I grew up right next to like the Indian neighborhood. <laughs> okay. I'm displaying my... Chicago yeah, is not ignorance. a flyer state. <laughs> there are... There is civilization there. All right. Well, you know. Did you ever eat a dish like this? Mom, Tell the truth. I, I, I did. I grew up right in an Indian neighborhood. I wore a sari for Halloween. <laughs> oh, oh, that's really PC. All right. Take back to your kitchen and make this dish. It's really good and really easy. <laughs> I'm sorry for Halloween. What kind I of did. Halloween costume was that? It was a real sari. They taught me how to wear it. <laughs> 